I think we came out really strong uh, starting off, and I think that we played well as a team. Like <clears throat> people have mentioned, like Asia and Maisha were being face guarded and doubled, and I think that a lot of people stepped up, like Jazz and Sam. So I think we played good as a team. A lot of the, the commentators around the country leading up to this game said this might be a big challenge for you guys. Yeah. Did you guys hear any of that talk coming into the game, and if so, did it motivate you a little bit? I mean, yeah, everything motivates us. I mean. We sometimes, I mean, you, we just got to play like us. If people say something, I mean, we know who we are. We know who we are as a group, and we just got to go out and play who we are. What did Coach Walls and the staff have to tell you guys? Is, when you come to the Sweet 16, things do get a little more yeah. tighter. What was the message from the coaching staff? Um, we have meetings before, and it was kind of like we're here for a reason. We're, our record is what it is, and so don't change what's not broke. So go out, play hard, do what we've been doing, focus on defense, focus, play for each other. Um, we have this thing, it's team, teammates, and me, so that's what we kind of go by. I mean, this is clearly the way you guys want to be playing in March. I mean, how exciting is it now to be in the Elite Eight playing so well? Oh, it's, it's super exciting. I mean, I can't wait to see what comes next. Yeah. No much about Oregon State yet? Um, I mean, they're a great team. They have a great coach. They have a lot of shooters, and they have a really good post. So it's going to be a it's gonna be a battle. What did you think of the crowd out here this season? It was amazing, especially for as late of the game as it was. They all came down here <clears throat> and supported us. So I think, I think it made the environment a little better.